Hey, the Reckoners, and welcome back. Today's indie game is Doors. Now, this is a game that the developer sent me a key for, so I'm going to check it out. It is a self-described as a first-person logic game, taking after such things as uh, the Stanley Parable and... Um, what was that other game I mentioned on the Steam Store page? I can't recall, but you get the idea. Something that seems pretty much right up my alley. Uh, so I guess let's see how well it can live up to these great expectations. I can do these controls. Oh, manual saving. Oh, how lazy. I don't know. Uh, I'm lazy. In every puzzle is a door that leads to a to bacon. All other doors lead to death. I see. This is going to be a series of choices, essentially. On every door is a statement. It may be true, and it may be false. It can be true and false at the same time. No, that's not what it says. If one statement on a door is true, then all statements on that door are true. If one statement on a door is false, then all statements on that door are false. This is a really... Slick effect. Red scares at night. I like this atmosphere. It's oddly like a it's like a piece of little bird. I think I was saying this before in Firewatch. I love background forest noises, uh, but the rest of the setting not quite so welcoming or friendly. Bacon is wonderful. We'll assume that's true. That didn't sound like a good sound you would expect from choosing the correct door. But I guess it was. Can I shift to run? I cannot. Ah, more doors. Like a camel. More door! What does this say? Exactly one door is correct. Okay. R and B. This door leads to bacon. The other door leads to death. One of these doors leads to bacon. The other leads to death. Um, so this one's definitely true, right? Yep, that great sound indicating success, not death. It doesn't sound like a guillotine chopping my body in little bits into bacon. <sighs> bacon. I haven't had bacon in quite a while. Exactly one door is correct. I mean that point home. Oh, did I choose incorrectly? It's a different path leading up. Oh, wait. Oh, it's different. Okay, these are slightly different. The correct door leads to bacon. The incorrect door leads to death. This door leads to death. The other door leads to bacon. So these ones... Loading means I died? No. Okay, game saved. Auto-saving, thank you for that. Can I go? No. Um, those were easy, on purpose, I'm assuming. They were more or less rule-describing. I love that sound of water. Man. If this game was like... Hmm, like Firewatch graphics. We have this. Oh, that's. Oh, man, this is cool! Okay, uh, bacon leads to happiness. This door leads to bacon. The other door leads to death. Both doors are correct. Bacon does not lead to happiness. That cannot be true. Cool, cool. Oh, this reminds me of. Uh, what's that other? Mind Path to Hellness? No. I can't remember. Yeah, that was it, right? Both? Wait. Either both doors are correct, or both doors are incorrect. Each door leads to either bacon or death. So, in that case, it doesn't matter which door I take, right? I don't have a not door as an option. I can either choose to die or not. Both doors lead to death. This door leads to bacon. Wait. Both doors... Oh, both are, if both are incorrect, then both doors don't lead to death, and this one doesn't lead to bacon. Oh god, there's three doors. Two doors are correct. One leads to bacon, the other two lead to death. Good to know. I didn't know, I didn't know that core rule is going to be changing. I like it, though. The green door leads to bacon. The red door leads to bacon. The red door leads to death. Only one leads to bacon. The red door is death. One of them is false. This this uh, LP may be some heavy editing, because watching me ruminate on logic 
may or may not be the most engaging thing on all of YouTube. Let's see, red door leads to death, the green door's bacon, the red door's bacon, only one door can lead to bacon. Um, I mean, clearly at first, my first reading, you know, wants you, it wants you to go to green. Because we have this thing going to green, this thing going to red, and this thing canceling out red, therefore leaving only green. Uh, but a door can be correct in terms of its text, but still lead to death. Definitely, that's going to be the case here. And a door can be wrong and still lead to bacon. So if that's wrong... Wait, two doors? Two doors are correct? God dang it. The, the two doors! I've never seen that show. <sighs> okay, two doors are correct. So if we take... Both of these can't be correct. So it's one of these is correct... And the blue is correct, right? So if the blue is correct, the red door leads to death. And the red door is wrong. Oh, no, wait. Oh, wait, the green and the blue, both of those can't be true. Got it. So we're going to... Both of these can't be true, which means red has to be true. So we're going to go with green! Yay, that should have gone my first instinct, I guess. Okay, got cacti. I like how we're changing biomes, although I missed the forest with the creek, that was nice. I also like how the creek sounds tuned out when I got to the puzzle, because that would have been possibly a little distracting. At least one door is correct. The correct door, or doors, lead to bacon. Maybe they're all correct. All three doors are correct. The blue door is incorrect. The red door is incorrect. So if the red door is incorrect, then that means less than the three doors are correct. Um, which means green is false, which is really going to blue. Hey, better lucky than good. Uh, that was logic. That was... Me being a genius. Why is there some light there? I don't know. I like this cave. Could be really spooky. Glad it's not spookier. That just loops back around. I'm pretty sure. I wonder how long this game actually is. It's a one-man team, which is nice. I mean, good job for that guy. He did. He did. He did good work. Hmm. Okay. Exactly two doors are correct. One door leads to bacon, the others lead to death. Okay, so two are correct, but only one is the right choice. Two are correct. This door leads to death. The incorrect door leads to bacon. The green door leads to bacon. So if two are correct, so that means blue and green cannot both be correct, which means for sure that red is correct. So red leads to death. If green is correct, and that means we should take red. If blue is correct, then that means we should take green. That doesn't contradict, does it? If that door leads to death and is correct, wait. Exactly two doors are correct. One door leads to bacon, the other leads to death. Only one door can lead to bacon. Oh wait, green... Contrad... wait. So green doesn't say red, right? Green says incorrect door. So if green is true... Then that means... Blue is bacon. And if blue is true... That means green is bacon. And exactly... wait. Oh, only one door leads to bacon, though. Dang it. Two doors are correct. This door leads to death. The incorrect door leads to bacon. The green door leads to bacon. Hmm, what am I missing? If this door leads to death, that means the other two, one of the other two. Maybe that's, if that's the wrong one, if both of these are true, if red's the wrong, if both of these are true, the green door leads to bacon. And the incorrect release to begin. Okay, so that... You're right, you're right. As, right. as right before, that cannot be true. But they both point to the other. I have no way... 
of knowing, no earthly way of knowing, if the rowers keep on rowing. Huh. You're probably screaming at me, the obvious thing that is wrong. Oh wait, but if, okay, so let's say if the green door's true, that's what I'm forgetting. If the green door's true, that means that it's the blue door. But if the blue door is false, then the green door is death. Okay, so we're gonna do that. Did I guess wrong? No, we're coming out of the cave. New cave, okay, oh jeebus. Four doors. Like a Tarantino movie. We're missing four rooms, of course. At least one door is correct. That's good, because if that wasn't true, we'd be screwed. Okay, at least two doors are correct. The green door leads to death. At least two doors are correct. So that's false, right? At least one door is correct. Not at least two? I'm not sure if that's an actual contradiction or not. So, maybe the green- I need, I need a pen and paper for this, practically. Exactly three doors are correct. This door leads to bacon. The green door leads to death. So, green and red cannot be true. Fewer than three do oh wait. Okay, but those- okay, other than that, that's fine. Fewer than three doors are correct. This door leads to bacon. So, blue and yellow cannot both be true. So these both claim to lead to bacon. They can't both be true. Let's assume red is true. The green door leads to death. So that negates green, which would mean yellow's also false, which would mean we should take blue. This it I don't like weird sounds playing in my ear, especially when they're not freaky voices. So this isn't real. This is a computer game. Are you, you know, okay, I'm gonna reserve judgment, but you don't need to do this game. Give me a series of logic puzzles is all I signed up for. It's all I want. You don't need to try and break the fourth wall with me on top of that. Let's see. Exactly one door is correct. The one, one leads to bacon, the other leads to death. Okay. Simple, simple. You will choose this door. The door that you will choose leads to death. So I'm gonna choose this door. You're right, red door. You were exactly right. Hey. Oh, I thought that bird was like a squeaky, like, friggin' wheel. I was expecting like a Goram child on a tricycle ghost to come get me. Exactly one door is correct. One leads to bacon. The others lead to death. You know, you should have gone cake or death. You missed out here. You will choose this door. The red door is correct. Only one door is correct. Okay. So... These both have to be false. Because they can't both be true. You will not choose this door. The door that you will choose leads to bacon. So if, if only one is true, only one is correct. So if I choose, if that's true, this one has to be true. Because if it's false, then I'm screwed. Hey, we're in the matrix. Oh, did I die? Oh, first mistake. Didn't put in the, they didn't put in the legwork, the mental legwork, okay. So if this door is false, the door that I will choose leads to death, right? Which means I'm screwed. There's no way I can win, right? Because the door I will choose will not lead to bacon. I mean, I don't, I'm not seeing the flaw in my logic here. If it said this door leads to bacon, I could see how that being false. But I'm saying, the door you will choose, I mean... Hmm. Hmm. Oh. I have to choose... No, I don't have to choose green. So, if green is the one true door... Alright, green has to be a false door. 
Oh, right, I see. So blue is the true door, green is the false door. That's a false. Wait, so if that's false, that means red is true. Wait, wait. If yellow's false... Oh, dear. If yellow is false... Oh, that means red is false. Okay, yeah, yeah, so who's green? Green! Great. Man, I'm really bummed I spoiled my perfect run. I was looking forward to those doors. This reminds me of Time Bandits. Is the Supreme Being gonna come after me, asking for his ma- That'd be kinda cool. Scare the crap out of me, but it'd be cool. Do not enter. Why well, don't I have a choice? That freaking robot door. It's like a mouth. A mouth? Of a robot from the... Uh... Oh, what was that comic I was reading? Oh, I already forgot. If you are reading this, everything is completely under control, and there is no reason to worry. Please sit quietly and wait for an attendant to take care of you. Take care of me. I like that button. That's a good button. Can't really hit it though. I don't have any. I don't have any controls, do I? In case of fire, grab your bacon and run like heck. I've woken up. I think. Can't remember where I am or why. Nobody here. Three seven four two. Happy platypus day. Subject evaluation. Are you correctly? I can't zoom in. Are you correctly? Some no. No so. Some no no bacon. Status. I if I'm three seven four two, that's not on the list. Well, the security breaches, control phase, operational. Uh, this is this is, this is friggin' what's um, do not read signs. What is SCC containment breach? I'm a rebel from reading that sign. <laughs> Secure, contain, protect. SCP containment breach. Please remain seated throughout the entire duration of your visit. That's sexist. Our aim is to keep this bathroom clean. Your aim would help. Other numpad lock. 3742. Ah, there's different doors. Maybe I don't have to remember. Is that camera following me? Oh, of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? Caution, you are being monitored. Notice, please do not stare at the security camera for longer than 20 seconds at a time, as this may cause them to feel insecure. As always, thank you for your cooperation. Did I already do that by mistake when I was just walking in the hallway? Did that count as staring at a camera? I'm going to assume yes, even though I hadn't seen this sign yet. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, that's 20 seconds. Close enough. I don't think. I do quite like first-person mazes. I'm not terribly good at them. That's a Reddit reference, isn't it? Finalist. I'm a finalist. Oh, man. If I see another moving thing, that's when things get too scurry for me. I think that's the correct way. So I'm going to check out this real quick, just to see if we can get any joke signs. We got a movie sign! I hear whispering. It's always good. Maybe this is the, maybe this is the actual correct way. Ex is that poop? That's clearly Hawaiian punch. That looks like somebody broke out. That's a little smiley face. That's this room? No, there's no chair. There are the two. This, that is this room, but it's not a live feed. Or maybe it's just an identical room. This room, I don't know. No farting, or no, what is that? That's uh, propelling yourself rapidly. I don't know. If you had rollerblades, that would be cool. I want to go back into the simulation. Oh god, I just not, I wasn't. I did not think that would actually happen. I didn't really want to go back in the simulation. I don't like choosing death by mistake. I guess the solution is don't choose death. I shall endeavor to live up to that. Exactly one door is correct. One leads to bacon. Three lead to death. What if one of these times the floor is going to be a freaking false? Okay, so exactly one is correct. So if red is true, then the incorrect door leads to bacon. But there are three incorrect doors, so that doesn't help at all. So we're going to assume red is false, which means... Oh, wait. Oh, if red is true, the correct door. Which would mean red itself. Okay, so red's an option. But if red is not true... Okay, I, mean, I think I, th I think red's not true. But it could be true. You will choose this door. You're definitely false. The red and blue... Red and blue... Both lead to death. If you're true... Then I should go with yellow. 
If green is true, then I should go with yellow. This door leads to death. Crap. Crap. Because if that's not true, then that means that door leads to bacon. If that's not true, so this has to be true. Wait. No. Because these both are true. Exactly one door is correct. Uh, if they're, which means they're both false, right? Which means I get to choose red. Oh no. Yes. Yes, I have to choose red. If, if these are both false, if these are both false, then I can't these, 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 these both can't be true. Oh man, I don't want to die. I don't want to die. But see, if they're both false, three lead to death. If they're both false, then that means this leads to bacon. And that says... That means red's the true door. No, it doesn't. Red's the false door. Wait, but that means the... Oh, wait, the incorrect door is to bacon. Okay, we're gonna go blue. Oh, no, wait, because that means yellow's false. Crap. That means all four are false, if I'm following that logic. <sighs> oh, wait. Ah. Uh, no. <laughs> no. The correct door. Oh dear, you mean the red and blue doors both lead to death. Is a false statement. This door leads to bacon. And then let me invert these. This door leads to bacon. Both of these don't lead to death, which means this could lead to bacon. I won't choose that door. The incorrect door leads to bacon. The correct door... If green is correct... Oh, man. Which one to choose? If I just straight up choose yellow... That means if blue is the... Okay, if blue is the only true door... That means that leads to death. Because this, this and means that this can be false, and blue can still lead to death, right? That would mean that red leads to bacon. Right, and red's an incorrect door, and yellow's an incorrect door. We're gonna go red! Don't show- okay. <laughs> you know, you know, no matter how often I'm right from here on out, it's not gonna make up for the fact that I should be dead now. Like, because whenever I play a game like this, um, I try to make it, is there also a skull here? I try to think of it like realistically. Like if I was realistically thrown into a fantasy world with a series of logic puzzles, could I make it through? The answer has already been proven no, because I died once. So even if I'm getting these ones right, it's nice. I like getting them right. I like not dying, but we already know Fohamner would perish in the fantasy world of puzzle. It is sad, but I mean, not terribly surprising, honestly. I don't have plot armor in real life, sadly. <sighs> okay, I'm not sure if I want to cut the episode here. I have no idea how long this game is. I'm not gonna cut it because... Oh gosh, five doors. Jeez. Jeez, you guys. Well, that's the rule. Exactly two doors are correct. One leads to bacon. Four lead to death. Two of these doors are correct. Okay, dear, dear sweet Bippy. I may have to break out the graph paper and Mr. Snip Snip, the editing scissors. For the, I mean, not literal scissors, I mean editing for the this video. So, let's say anyway. <clears throat> either the red or green doors, okay, lead to bacon. Could be true. The red 
and green doors both lead to death. Okay, so you guys cannot both be true. The yellow and purple doors are both incorrect. I like that. Let's, let's get the purple real quick. The red door leads to bacon. Oh, well, that's false. I thought the yellow... Green... Okay, that's fine. Oh, wait, only one door... Oh, yeah. So green door's a good option right now. This one says, the door that leads to bacon is also correct. We're going green! Logic! Ho! Oh, crap. Okay. Once again, I neglected to put in mental legwork. I was just so happy to see a possible solution right off the bat that I leapt for it. That was a mistake. So we are going to engage fast forward mode and I will explain my logic bef um, I guess before each time I attempt to go through a door I'll explain my logic. And then we can see if I'm wrong or not each time. Fantastic. Okay, let's go. Oh, that was my mistake. I assumed, I took blue, I said, blue is true, therefore I can go in green. But only two doors are correct, and we already assumed they were green and red. So, let's just assume that the correct doors are yellow and purple, right? Uh, those lead to death. I mean, we already, we already know why is partially true. And the red door leads to bacon, so we're gonna go with red. Again, we're not putting them into legwork. Okay, from now on... Man... I mean, at this point, I know two doors are wrong, or I know they're death. That gives me so much extra information that I'm practically just brute forcing this puzzle, and that's really disgraceful. <laughs> it's not the it's not it's not the spirit of this game. Um, it is kind of like a little reward or a little slap on the wrist almost for failing. Like, oh, you failed. Here's a little hint. You know this kind of information now. But I would have liked to have solved it logically. Let's see. <laughs> After talking it up, if I can get this third guess right. I sure friggin' hope so. Man, I'm embarrassed. Okay, I'm pretty confident about this. I don't know if I could have gotten here without having the hint, at the, but um, I think the correct doors are yellow. We know for a fact yellow is correct. We have evidence. We have fully tested it. Yellow is true. So, uh... I'm pretty sure that means blue can't be true. Oh no, wait, shoot. Oh wait, blue has to be true, right. Yes, blue, yeah, yellow and blue are the true doors. Uh, we know purple's false, we know uh, yellow and purple are both incorrect. We're, we're assuming green's false, and... Oh wait, but if either the yellow or the green leads to bacon, that means... Both the yellow and the green door can't lead to picking crap. Okay, never mind. Never mind! Uh, let's uh, keep pondering. Oh, wait, yes, okay. Right. Let's go, it's blue. Right, right, okay, so that red, if red's false, then it's yellow. Okay, we're going blue. We're going blue. Oh, thank goodness. Some small measure of dignity is restored to me. This reminds me of Mist. Uh, one of the books you go to, not the main island. It's a puzzle where you wander through a little bayou. I, I've wanted to go to a place like this in real life sometime, where you walk on a wooden... catwalk? Pier? Boardwalk? Through nature? I'm pretty sure I have at some point in my childhood, but the memories are as muddled as this fog. Four doors, okay, back into four. That means it's easier, right? The statements on each door are either both correct or both incorrect. Left refers to my left. That is important to know. Uh, that first part is obvious. That's a rule. That is a rule. You cannot change that rule. Can I back off? No. Good. Okay. The door directly to the right of this one is incorrect. How many doors are true? There's only one statement. I don't know how many doors are true. Okay. Okay, so this is if this is false, let's see. The door directly to the left of this one leads to death. The door directly to the right of this one is incorrect. 
So assuming red's true, that means that this leads to bacon. So we should just take it right now. But we're not going to, we're putting them into legwork. So assuming this is false, that means this green one is also true. So let's see if that contradicts with red. The door directly to the left of this one leads to death. That holds up. The door directly to the right of this one is incorrect. So that holds, there's no contradiction there. Which means this has to be incorrect. If this is, if this has to be true, then the whole thing falls apart. The door directly to the left of this one leads to death. I buy it. Which means... But wait, which one has bacon in it? Um... Alright, oh yellow. Yellow's the only one. I see. I see. Hmm. I don't... I'm super... Lacking in confidence with my first... My first impressions now. Let's do it in reverse just to make sure everything holds up. Let's do it in reverse. So assuming this is true, and this leads to death, then this can still be true, which means that leads to death, and that one's false. Which means this leads to bacon. Okay, so we're going with green in this way. Uh, so this is false, right? No, you said just this, this, this leads to death. That's all you said. Okay. So now you say this leads to death, and this one's false. So if this is false now, then that means this is true again, and you lead to bacon, and yellow leads to bacon, and you lead to death. I don't know how many are true is the problem. The door directly to the right of this one is incorrect. It's basically red or yellow, I believe. Um, and it's kind of just on which one you believe. Huh. So the door to the left is a death. If that's true, that's fine. The door to the right is false. If this is false, then that does lead to bacon. And this guy's correct, and this guy's correct. Then you lead to bacon. Ah, okay, so you can't be true. So it has to be red, right? Friggin' what? Oh, I was... I was fairly confident in that. Oh, uh, okay, so let's see if... Green leads to bacon. What does the red door say? Does the red door say that the yellow door is incorrect? That's all it says? Okay, that's all you say is this one is false. You say, so we tried green. What did we just try? Oh crap. We lost all. We forgot everything. Wait, so if this is false. Oh, we tried green, didn't we? No, we tried red. We tried red. We tried red. So that means. The yellow door is true, <laughs> okay, which means green is false, which means yellow is the correct option. <sighs> Could I have gotten that, that that tidbit of information theoretically? I don't know. I don't. I'm not checking. Unfortunately, I'm not putting in the time to uh, check these logical puzzles for consistency because ideally, ideally, you can logic these out and never die if you put in the time and the thought. Um, I don't know, I don't know if that holds up. I don't know how well these are crafted. I assume, I'm going to assume that I'm being hasty for the purposes of an LP, and that is where the fault lies, not in the construction of the puzzles.